All right, all right, all right, all right. You motherfuckers are going to keep on with the fucking bullshit with this guy. Look, man. Ape Nation will just fucking hit the nail right motherfucking on the head. This is what happens when you're down a lot of money. Okay, it's what I told you guys. The word is tilt in poker. For those that play poker, you know what tilt means. And this man is on full life tilt, it's called. That's when it's just all going wrong. And he's down a lot of fucking money. Does anybody think that this guy is going to hold past? He won't even wait for 53. There is no fuck away. If this shit runs into the 30s and 40s, he's gone. But that would be a big favor to the community anyway. But that's for damn sure. That motherfucker ain't holding to Pluto. He ain't holding to the moon. He ain't holding to the earth. He ain't holding to the ground. That motherfucker is selling ASAP. So, here's my fucking question to the community. Who is subbed to this guy? Because I've been trying to expose bodism for a while now. And if everybody's sitting here saying, I'm not subbed to him, I'm not subbed to him, I'm not subbed to him. Who the fuck is subbed to him? Who is watching him? I know it's not a lot of views. But who is the 200? Who's the 300? Who's watching? I mean, I mean, I can kind of answer that question right now. Clearly, we're watching even though we're not subbed. So I can see where it, it makes sense there. But who's actually still subbed? You don't need to be subbed to him in order to watch his videos. I'm not subbed, but I'll just put in the search bar, hey, father, and I'll go watch. Unfortunately, we're all drawn to it. And you know what? He did make a couple videos that were funny. But all I'm trying to say is, bro, why don't you guys just line it up? Yo, Lou, honestly, bro, you're looking soft. Because if you can't take the eight father out, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said his name. I apologize. But I did. I'm going to call him that guy. Lou, if you can't take that guy out, then something's up, bro. And I know you've got some sort of head issues or something. And maybe you're worried about that. But at least come clean. Like, just be like, yo, I would beat the fuck out of you. But I'm having some issues right now. And at least we would all understand. But please don't use the attorneys and the law enforcement for that guy. Like, come on. That's the one in life that you say, you know what? I'm willing to get into that fight. I'm willing to knock that motherfucker out. Or at least get into the fight. But please, Lou. Attorneys, stop. YouTube, legal, stop. Police, stop. Mr. Elk Spaghetti, come on. You're all the way in what? Cali, stop. Like, I know you guys are boys and stuff, but like, let's keep it real, bro. And the crazy thing is, like, I see a lot of things the same way you do. Um, but come on, bro. I know that's your homeboy, but like, just stop. Your homeboy is just going to have to get with it. And that's it. Just line that shit up right. That's all you got to do. Look, in Miami, we just that's how we call it. We just say line that shit up. And we just line it up, bro. You don't even have to use bare knuckles, bro. Just do some, get some boxing gloves. Get into a ring. Set it up. We'll all fucking watch. You guys will make money. Nobody will get fucking permanent, permanently damaged. And just put something on the line. Like, yo, put the channels on the line. Whoever wins, you got you to gotta shut the, the channel off. And that's it. But please, line it up already. Because this shit is just getting real stupid. And as far as AMC is concerned, we all knew we were going to get here. So why? I don't understand why everybody's freaking out now. We thought this shit might get dragged down to 10. And maybe even worse. So why is there? Are we, I'm not freaking out. Look. We said it long time ago, this money that we put in, or we were bullshitting, that we were going to say this money is going to zero. Because for me, it's going to zero. I'm too far, like, it's getting too far away from my break-even point. I'm now somewhere in, like, probably 22, 23 average. And where am I at now? 15-ish? So I'm getting pretty far away from break-even. I'm closer to zero. So if I'm closer to, look, poker reference, Okay. <laughs> When you buy in, you go to a poker table and you sit down. Let's just say you put $200 on the table. 
and you get dwindled down to $50, I promise you 99.9% .9 of people are going to run that 50 all the way in. They're not going to be like, ah, let me just save this 50 bucks. I'm just not running well today. I'm not doing well. That money's getting shipped in somewhere. Ace 10 is looking lovely for $50. Okay. So what is anybody worried about? And I'm sorry, if you guys don't understand poker, like there's a lot, there's, you know, every field, every field that has a following has their own language. Stock has their own language. Poker has their own language. Video games have their own language. Sports have their own language. I'm using poker terminology. Some of you that play poker understand what I'm saying, but to break it down a little further for you guys, if you sit down at a table with $200 and you've been losing and you've got 50 or $25 left, you're not scooping that money up and saying, all right, I've had a bad day. I'm out of here. I'm just going to save this money. 99.9% .9 of people are not doing that. They're going to call they're going to do what it's called shipping it. They're going to ship it in and it's going to be on the most marginal hand that you probably would have played when you had $200 to hope to get lucky that three people call your bet and maybe you get your $200 back. But let me tell you what. 7 out of 10 times you lose it. So just chill with AMC. Chill. Shit's about to get so much worse, and it ain't just the stock market. The whole fucking world is about to get worse. There's a lot of shit, a lot of bad shit still coming. A lot of, a lot of bad shit is here, and a lot more bad shit is coming, so you people better start getting your minds right, because if you think the stock market is the worst of your frustrations, there's so many, 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 many more. And to be honest with you, if the shit crashes badly... The ones that might survive are the meme stocks. So just hold on tight. Like I told you guys, this was going to happen. You weren't going to, you would you think you were going to fucking buy AMC for 20 and the, like in a month they were going to be like, hey, it's a thousand. It's 2,000, 50,000. That's what you thought. You guys hated me when I told you in the beginning, but now you've gotten to know me and now <laughs> months have gone by and you have seen, oh shit, this guy was kind of right. They're not going to give us this fucking money. But you don't you can't sell it because you're not going to ever get any kind of payoff if you don't hold the ticket. You can't just come back later and say, oh, well, I should be a part of that now. No, because if we finally get to where we got to go in order to get the answers or get settled out, I'm looking at I want to get settled out at this point. I think they should shut the fucking meme stocks down. OK, talk to every shareholder, send them an email, say, hey, listen, we know you're you're a holder of this stock let's say it's amc you're a holder of amc we're shutting it down um we're gonna pay you guys out okay and uh here's here's the here's what it is it's definitely your, your all your losses will be covered because it'll be an amount over uh the highest point that amc has reached or the highest point that gamestop has reached and maybe a little sprinkle on top so maybe it's like let's just say they come out and they're like We'll give you guys 500 a share on AMC. You're going to turn that down? If the alternative is, then you don't get shit. Go fucking kick rocks. Because what the fuck? You, who are you going to fuck up? Who are you going to beat up? Who the fuck are you going to beat up? Nobody even knows who to fuck up if you don't want that offer. If the offer was $500 a share, get the fuck out of AMC. They offer it to you. They settle it. They shut the, st the stock down. They say, I'm give we're giving you $500 a share. It's that or nothing. Who are you going to say, no, I decline. I'm, I'll go fuck up whoever has my money. Who? Who is that? Who is that? You work nine to five, Monday to Friday. You're not prepared to deal with any of that stuff. You got money to find whoever the fuck that is. You're going to take the $500 happily and you're going to say, peace out. So you guys got to get on board. I've been telling you, make the videos, show that you're a true owner of the stock. It's going to matter later. You can't just be like, oh, just take my word for it, bro. Like the, the bots are going fucking nuts, by the way, on my videos. They do not. This is how you know that it's a fucking good golden plan that's going to work. The bots are going fucking batshit crazy on the comments. I this fucking guy he's a crying baby these fucking crazy ideas blah 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 this is illegal blah 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 they're going fucking nuts and i don't even answer them no more so they're going even more nuts guys listen 
all of our social media has been infiltrated. You know why? Because it's already common knowledge now that nobody trusts mainstream media. So you get infiltrated in the comments. Now, is it in-house that they're doing it in this, in this country? Could be, could be, but it's largely outside of this country, okay? They're influential powers. Just like I'm here talking to you, okay? I'm now an influencer. That's what I am. Um, but this country could not be cracked from the outside. So whoever's doing it has figured out that they had to infiltrate within um, our social platforms, divide us up, and just get, and it's working. It's working to a T, and it, it probably cannot be fixed anymore. So that's why I'm asking you if, if love and support still exist, it has to happen electronically, and it has to happen fit visually. If you don't believe in that, then you might as well just succumb to whatever's coming in the future. But as I'm looking at the screen, looks like I'm at 11 minutes, and I don't want the people with such a small attention span to be like 11 minutes this fucking guy with his videos are too long i'm not watching Kyle wicks hyping is out thanks for watching